Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Hanging with Miss Brianna Live. We are ready to rock and roll this morning. It's a little chilly. Yesterday was so nice outside. And then today, excuse me, we wake up and it's super cold. But I have my cup of coffee in one of my favorite mugs. It says football, flannels, and hoodies. And if this doesn't scream fall and I guess preparing ourselves for winter, right? Because we had some snow not that long ago, but here we are today, which I'm really excited to be with you guys today. So uh, let's get going. So today we're gonna do story time. Um, we've been so busy here at the Y, we just, um, finished up a party with a purpose. Um, so anybody who was able to join us for that great fundraising event, um, it was amazing, it was great. Um, it was you know nice to be able to do the things that we still do here at the Y, but with a twist, um, which was amazing. So all of our financial development team and marketing team has been really busy, so we're, we apologize that we didn't get today's um, uh, segment or um, what we were going to do uh, pushed out to you guys. So we're going to read a story. And this book um, I was going to read, I think a little while ago, but we weren't able to, oh, because we were doing, um, I think we had internet issues or Facebook was having issues, that kind of thing. So it's called All of Us. Um, and I wanted to read this story today because you know, we're living in this time when things are so different. Uh, we're living during the time of a pandemic and it's really been hard on all of us. And I wanted to read this story because I think it really just gives it um, much more meaning to when we say that we're in this together, we really mean that we're in this together. So um, let's get going and read the story and then uh, we can talk about it some more, but then I'll get to share uh, some other fun things that we're going to do next week. So here we are, all of us. And hi from 4K. Hello, 4K friends. Thanks for joining me. So all of us. When your heart is heavy, and your steps unsure, When the winds are wild, and the path unclear, don't fear the night so dark and vast. Or the hazy future. or the stormy past. Know that I am here as steady as a stone. We are stronger together. Then we are alone. Hope and light will always prevail. For love wins. It sure does win. Look at all these people of all different cultures and backgrounds and ethnicities, young and old children, our favorite pets, love sure does win. Love wins. Love will never fail. 
What a great book. What a great reminder that even during these unpredictable times and times that seem challenging, that again, remember that page where those two hands were joined together and that we are definitely stronger together. And I have to say that I have probably felt that the most here at the Y um, and being able to continue to do what I do every day and ensuring that all of our kiddos have access to quality childcare, but also having a team that even though during those challenging times we stick together, everybody in our building here continues to stick together and to lean on each other. So always remember that granted we may at times feel like we're standing alone, but really all of us together will make it together and that love will always win. So next week, we are going to do some cooking in the kitchen. Um, and probably one of my, I shouldn't say one of my favorite, favorite dips, but pretty darn close. We are going to make pumpkin pie fluff dip. I'm really excited about it. If this says anything like fall, this is definitely it. So if you wanna join us at home and make your pumpkin pie fluff dip, it's like a tongue twister, gotta say it super slow. You need one 15 ounce can of pumpkin, one package of Jell-O vanilla flavor instant pudding, one teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, and one tub of Cool Whip topping, and make sure it's thawed so that it can stir up easily into all of the rest of the ingredients. Now, you can pair whatever you would like uh, with your dip. Um, you could do graham crackers, you could do animal crackers, um, apple slices, peach slices, anything that you would like to dip in your um, pumpkin pie fluff dip, get creative. Um, and it'll be interesting to see what ideas you guys come up with. So I'm super excited about next week. Um, and I've been thinking of some new ideas um, to do on our Facebook Live. Um, and of course, we wanna hear from you guys, our viewers, that if you have anything that you would like to see me do, whether it's a movement, it, movement and music activity, um, a book that you would recommend, an art activity that you would like to see, um, any kind of science or math, um, please put those ideas out there for me so that we can keep this interesting, we can keep it fun, and I can keep you guys with a plethora of ideas um, to use um, you know, during any time. And especially with the winter months coming, um, it seems that we may be inside more than we get to be outside. So I am gearing up to do some fun things uh, within the next couple of weeks and into the new season. So, of course, I always enjoy my time here with you all. And so I'm going to leave you with a hug, lots of love, and of course a kiss. Have a fantastic Thursday, everyone. And I will tell you, the classroom is open. Our last classroom is open and ready for kiddos. If you are looking for new childcare and need to get that kiddo out of the house and having some fun, know that Miss Brianna um, will open her doors to any child needing childcare. Our room is ready, rocking and rolling, ready to go. All of our new toys are in. So that is my push and my plug to come see me at the East Y. If you know anybody or you yourself needs great um, quality childcare, I'm your lady. So, of course, I will send you off again with a hug, lots of love, and two kisses this time. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.